Hey everybody, it's Shannon Massey, Associate Executive Director with Monate, and I want to show you really quickly, if you want to look at someone on your team, just that person's leg, just that person's organization, you want to single that person out and just see who on their team is active, who, who has personal volume, what is it, how many active lines do they have, what's their current paid as rank, how close are they to ranking up uh, to the next level. I'm going to show you how to do that. And this is a report that I use very, very often. So here I am in Vibe. <clears throat> Pardon me. I'm going to go to the Market Partner Search Report. And I'm going to come up here to Advanced Filter Options. So I'm going to tell this report exactly what I want it to pull. Um, so after I've got the, ex okay, so here we go. We have at the top, we have constraints. I'm not even going to worry about any of these fields right here. I am going to come down right here to where it says find consultant. And this is me telling the, the vibe, okay, who do I want to look at? Whose team do I want to look at? I don't want to look at my entire organization. I want to look at this particular market partner and their organization. So I clicked on find consultant. And now I'm going to click on, I want to look just at Cindy Thomas's team. So I'm doing Cindy Thomas. I hit double click on the search magnifying glass there. I find Cindy. I click on her consultant number. And now Cindy is in here. Cindy has been put at the top of this report. And it's going to pull uh, Cindy's entire organization. I'm only going to be able to pull what I, what I want to see for Cindy's uh, organization. So now that I've clicked on her and it's brought me back to here, I'm going to scroll down to the, where this output is and these blue boxes. This is the data that I can pull onto this report. I can have every single one of those um, items right there of data pulled into columns on this report, but I don't need them all, nor do I want them all. I just want to see name, personal volume, group volume, and um, how many active legs somebody has and what their current paid as rank is. So I'm going to make sure the, the, the pieces of data that I want to pull in are highlighted in blue. Everything else I don't want has been unchecked. And now I'm going to run the report. Okay, so I uh, here's Cindy's organization. She's at the top here. This is every market partner in Cindy's organization. I can see what level they are. A level one would be her personally sponsored. A level two would be somebody that she sponsored, uh, who they sponsored, so kind of like her grand market partner. And I can see what everybody's current rank is, what their personal volume is, what their group volume is, how many active lines they are, that type of thing. So. At the top here on these headers, you'll see these little arrows. And if you click on those headers, it's going to automatically sort the entire report in ascending or descending order. So I clicked on it twice because I want to put the highest GV at the top. And I want to look at that. And um, obviously, I can see where Haley has incredible GV, her personal volume, how many active lines she has, and what her current paid as rank is. Um, so this is a really, really helpful tool if you want to look at just any market partner in your entire organization, doesn't matter where they are, but if you want to look at someone that's your level, you know, eight, you can just put in that person's name under the find a consultant uh, tab that we first clicked on, and it's going to pull in any market partner's um, on that person's team. So let me do it one more time and I'll show you a different one. I'm going to go back to, I'm sorry, I'm going to go back to um, the advanced filter options. I'm going to click on find a consultant again. And I happen to know that Angela Justice in Arkansas ranked up to uh, associate market builder. And I want to just see who's under Angela, who's on Angela's team and what they have going on. I want to see how close Angela is to her next rank up. So I put in Angela's name. I double clicked on her market partner number. Now Angela is set at the top and I'm going to come down here and run the report based on Angela's team. And here we go. I see the market partners on Angela's team. I can see how much personal volume they have, how much group volume they have, how many active lines they have, etc. And, um, and I'm able to get a good view 
of Angela and her organization. And you're doing fabulous, by the way, Angela. To be a new market partner, you are just really building very strong and just gonna have a solid foundation to your organization. So that's just how you can run this report. Super, super helpful. I run this a lot in the last couple of weeks of the month, certainly in the last week of the month and daily on, uh, if I know someone's close to ranking up, I'm looking to see who they have that's close to the, to the next rank up that they might need for their structure and that type of thing. And I do this on my phone as well. So this is, this is a report you can uh, run the same way on your phone or on the computer. So if you have any questions, let me know and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.